Good morning, everyone. With what's been said in the past assemblies and also all over the media, I think that the most valuable thing that we can do is to learn how we can actually help the Black Lives Matter movement. I know that the pupils that said were quite informed on this because we have social media, so I hope that this assembly can reach parents who maybe don't already know how they can help. I think that some of us may find it quite easy to brush off the things that we see on the media, but it's actually relevant to all of us because we can't get equality until we all stand together and do something about it. Being against racism isn't really enough. We have to be proactively anti-racist. So today I'm speaking about some ways that we can all get involved. And um, they don't require much effort either. So the first thing is to donate. Um, you can find so many good websites online if you just search up how can I donate to support the Black Lives Matter movement. There'll be a link put under this video which takes you to a website which I think is a really important cause. And you can donate to reform the police system in America because it's proven to be inherently racist. If donating is not your thing, that's absolutely fine. You can help out by signing petitions. These petitions want to get justice for black lives that were taken by cops who haven't been charged. Uh, I'll leave another link below. Thirdly, you can do your part in making sure that the Black Lives Matter movement doesn't just become a trend. If you're on social media, just make sure that you, you keep reposting and keep the momentum up so that it doesn't just fade out as time goes on. Finally, I think another way that we can help is by educating ourselves as much as we can about the topic. This goes especially to white people because we have no insight into what it's like to face racism on the daily. Uh, also, these problems are caused by white people's ignorance, so it's our responsibility that we have to fix. One way that we can educate ourselves is by watching films on Netflix. Um, I know of two that gives really good insights into what it's like to face racism. Uh, there's one called The Hate You Give, and the other one is called Thirteenth. Also, we can search up on the internet some articles to read. Um, if you just search up uh, things I didn't realise were racist, you'll be surprised as to how many articles come up. You could read a couple of those. Thank you for listening. I'm going to close with a prayer. Dear God, thank you for giving us all the opportunities to help people in need and to solve the injustices that we see in society. Please help anyone watching this assembly to take something from it and be proactive in helping as much as they can. Amen.